Hey, what's up YouTube fam? Check it out guys. I said I was going to get on here and when one of these ghost ghost peppers got ripe and do a little burn session. Look at the size of this thing. And this one's not the bigger of the bunch that's out there. This is kind of one of the medium ones. And what it's, I don't know what it's crossed with, but man, check it out. Look at these pimples and everything on it. You know what? Hang on just a second. I'm going to get a better video. Use the light and everything. I'm going to insert it at this point and then come back. Hang on just a minute. Okay, check it out, guys. Look at this thing. It's beautiful. These peppers are a lot hotter than any ghost pepper I've ever eaten. They are definitely up there in the super hot range. And when I say super hot, I'm talking about surpassing a million, which, you know, ghost peppers can do that. But now watch me eat this one, and it's like just like regular ghost pepper. But this is crossed with something. Hang on, let's use the flashlight here. There we go. This is definitely crossed with something. Um, beautiful pod. Beautiful, mean-looking pod. But... What it's crossed with, I have no idea, but it is way hotter than any ghost I've ever eaten. This is definitely, um, well, let's just get into eating it and find out how hot this particular one is. I'm just talking about the ones that have come off the plant now. Oh, man, you know, I forgot. I was going to eat this directly off the plant. I'm like, like, pick it in the video. Um, set the camera up in front of the, I'll do that for another video. That's, that's a good idea for another video. So let's get back into uh, eating this. Okay, so we're back, and I'm anxious. I haven't eaten anything hot since last week, and... You know, I might uh, get a little something off of this for sure. I believe I will. But let's get into it. And, man, this is just such a beautiful pot. I almost just don't want to eat it for that sake alone. But, Mmm, mmm, mmm. Maybe I should just cut it open. Mmm, it's delicious. Oh, very fruity. Oh, it's really hot. I ain't got any placenta yet. Mmm. This one's hot. I ain't never eaten ghost pepper that hot. <clears throat> wow. <clears throat> that, folks, is a hot pepper. Wow. <laughs> Let's give it a second here. And, you know, it's on the throat, but it's all over the mouth. Mmm. It's even got on lips somehow. <laughs> I think I'm at about three. My goodness. This ranks up there with some of the hotter peppers I've eaten. And I would say, oh, it's probably my tolerance. I'm like a week off and stuff like that, but I don't think so. I was eating mother peppers pretty easily. Ooh. <laughs> I'm lying, I'm dying. Uh, I ain't no method actor. I don't make up tears. <laughs> it's my great to back and throat some. Wow. The tongue's really, really on fire. Is that about a four? Maybe a little four and a half? I ain't never... My needle's never moved since I've been doing this hot stuff from a ghost pepper. Of course it has... Amber Alert. Man, they've been going off left and right. Crazy here in Houston, man. But um, I um, yeah. When I first ate a ghost pepper, of course, my I wasn't eating peppers like that. A habanero was a habanero was hot to me back then. I gotta find out. I mean, I really want to find out what this is. That is one hot pepper. I'm not gonna say it's hotter, hottest pepper in the world. It's not hotter than a hell hammer. I don't think. In my opinion, it's hotter than probably every any Carolina Reaper I've ever eaten. It ranks up there with the scorpions. I don't know, no. I don't think I don't think a scorpion. I know when my tolerance is way up there, um, a scorpion maybe at a one or two. Hellhammers at a four or five, maybe a six. Um, depending on the hellhammer. I've had some hellhammers that weren't near as hot as other hellhammers. So that's a, it's a you know, hit and miss sometimes too with any pepper. But so far, every one I pulled off of that plant has been hot. It's definitely peaked. Um, I'm going to give that one a four and a half. Uh, four and a half. Wow. All right, y'all. Be looking forward to I, I might send some of these out to some other people and let them try them. Get in the comment section, and you let me know if you want to try one of these. All right, y'all.